Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Tori, and today's video is going to be another toddler boy clothing haul. I have items, a ton of items from Walmart, and then a few items from Old Navy. They all just came out with their spring stuff, so I wanted to go ahead and grab things before they started to sell out. If you're a mom, you know if you see it, you like it, you better get it because once the weather starts warming up, things tend to, tend to sell out. So um, I have a lot to go over, so let's just go ahead and jump in. So I'll start with the Old Navy stuff. Like I said, they just brought out their spring clothes, and while it's still pretty cold outside right now, I knew that I wanted to go ahead and grab things um, because things tend to sell out. And also Old Navy had a sale for like 50% off, I think. So these were new items and they were really affordable. So I always recommend watching out for Old Navy because I've never bought anything for Grayson full price. They always have sales and I'm pretty sure their sales go anywhere from like 30 to like I've seen up to 60%. So all that to say, never pay full price for these items. But the first set that I got was a t-shirt and short set. And he is kind of in between sizes, so I'm hoping that this fits him. It's an 18 to 24 month, and he's wearing 18 month stuff right now. So I'm hoping that this fits him during the spring, but it should. Um, but it's this really pretty like coral color with like light blue stripes. And it's kind of like a towel-y terry cloth material. So I know this is going to be comfortable for him and I just love this color and it came with matching shorts and then I also got the same set in a blue color and I love putting blue on him because he has blue eyes and I think it makes his eyes pop. So I love this color on him and I think that I'm going to love these sets on him. They have that set and I wish I had got it when it was on sale because the sale has already gone away but they have like a green and yellow striped one that I really really want to get now that I have these and I have felt them. I think I'm going to love those so I'm going to probably pick that other set up as soon as they go back on sale. The next set or the next item is this little linen romper. I hope this fits like I said he's in between sizes but this does not stretch. Um, so hopefully this fits him. If not, I'll return it, but it's a very cute pattern. It just has these like primary color bugs on it. And I like, he runs hot and we also live in the South, so it gets hot in the summer. So I like that this is a very light and breathable material. Next thing I got is this sleeveless romper and it has these little blue smiley faces on it and these Henley buttons and it is a waffle knit material. This is so soft and stretchy and I think he will be super comfortable in this. And I like this for transitioning from spring, well, from winter to like spring um, when it still is a little bit chilly outside but not cold enough for like a long sleeve or a jacket. So yeah, this is one of my favorites. The next set is another t-shirt and short set and this one is also in an 18 to 24 months and it's a like cream color with these colorful dinosaurs on it um, i know i've mentioned this in one of my previous videos that i never thought i would be that mom that dressed their kid in all of these characters and bright colored dinosaurs but they can't just wear beige everything <laughs> so and i think this one's really cute it's like the best of both worlds. It's still a cream color. It's still neutral and wearable, but it also has the colors and the dinosaurs on it. So it's the best of both worlds. And then I got him a basic Old Navy t-shirt. I honestly would love this in an adult size. Um, I tend to dress him how I would like to be dressed, to be honest. <laughs> But anyway, this is a super thin, nice, light gray t-shirt. This is this is in a size 2T. I feel like I'm kind of holding on to the baby sizes because they have cuter stuff, I feel like, than toddler sizes. 
Um, but that is something in a toddler size that I like, so I guess that's okay. I should probably mention too that my son is a little over a year old um, and he's in the 98th percentile, so he is a larger baby. So he is, like I said, currently in 18 month clothing, but I'm buying things for the coming season. So I'm trying to buy them a little bit larger, but I think he will probably slow down on the growth spurts at this point. So he should be able to wear all of this. But the last thing I got from Old Navy are these sandals. And I, again, got these in an 18 to 24 month. He had these when he was like three months old, I think, in a darker color or maybe six months old. And obviously he grew out of them and didn't need to be wearing these in the winter. But I wanted to get them again for spring and I got them in a lighter color this time. So I haven't tried these on him. I don't know if these are going to fit. He currently wears like a size four shoe, but he's not walking but he should start walking very soon. So I wanted to get him some sandals for the warmer weather and I love these. I think these are so cute on girls or boys. And honestly, that's like the story of his entire wardrobe. I feel like there's a lot of gender neutral stuff um, and that's intentional because I'd like to be able to use some of it for um, future babies, God willing. So that's all from Old Navy. I have a ton of stuff from Walmart, so let's get into that now. Um, I have really come to love Walmart's toddler and baby clothing section. However, I do want to mention that sometimes it's actually not cheaper. Like I can sometimes get things from Old Navy or Carter's on sale and even Target on sale that ends up being cheaper than Walmart. So just keep that in mind. Um, I used to go crazy at Walmart and then realizing I was spending more on some of the Walmart items than like the other companies like Old Navy and stuff. So just keep that in mind. But I did really like these pieces so I wanted to pick these up. Um, this is a really cute set that I found. It has Snoopy on it and it comes with two t-shirts and a pair of shorts. So this is a three piece set. So this is a really good deal. It was $15, I believe. So, I mean, it's, it's good because you're getting three pieces. So it's not a bad price at all. And I like to have simple things like this to send him to daycare in that I don't necessarily care if he ruins. And this next set I actually saw on TikTok and I had been hunting this item down. I love dressing him in things that are like, retro style like remind me of the 90s or like something I would have wore as a kid and that is exactly what this reminded me of so I got him this Mickey Mouse overall set and this these overalls are like a thin kind of stretchy like denim and they have Mickey Mouse's printed and then this is like a raised Mickey print and then with this cute little t-shirt with the pop of orange. Like, I absolutely love this. I think this is so darling. I cannot wait to put him in this. And I did get this in a size 24 months, so I'm hoping that this fits him good. But yeah, if you see this, you've got to snag it because it is so cute. The next two pieces that I got are contenders for Easter outfits. I don't know what the weather is going to be like. You never know in Georgia. So I got a short sleeve and short set and a long sleeve and pant set. And I'll probably just return whichever one he can't wear. But the first one is this super cute little blue floral print collared shirt with like a darker gray blue short with suspenders. I think this is so cute. I got it in a size 24 months because these shorts aren't super stretchy and I didn't want them to be super tight but this could potentially be too big. We'll just have to see but I thought it was so cute and it was only $16 so that's a pretty good price for an Easter outfit. I think for his first Easter we paid like $26 for his outfit and he wore it one time so I didn't want to spend a ton of money but he can also use this for other events or like church or something but that's the first option and then the second option is this blue checkered collared shirt with green pants again these aren't super stretchy um but they do have an elastic on the back 
to help with that. And then it does also have the suspenders and I love suspenders and like bow ties on little boys. It's so darling. But yeah, this is another option. I did get this in an 18 month because when I held up the 24 month, it looked massive. So again, whichever one he wears will depend on what the weather is like and then which one fits him, obviously. But yeah, this one was also $16, so a really good price. And if you have like um, more than one baby, you have a boy and a girl or a boy and a boy, they did have matching sibling outfits, which I thought was really nice. So the next category of stuff I'm gonna kind of fly through, um, Walmart has a brand called Granimals and they're super affordable and I have found that I love to buy a ton of that brand because it's cheap and because I like to send my son to daycare in it. That way if he gets it dirty, if he gets food on it, if he ruins it, then I'm not out a bunch of money. So there are a lot of things I probably went overboard but you can mix and match a lot of these items and like I said I recommend picking them up when you see them because I feel like they're trending on TikTok I feel like a lot of people have caught on and they do tend to sell out fast and I don't really think that Walmart restocks them too much so if you see them and you like them I would highly suggest going ahead and grabbing them but the first little category I have is these t-shirts they have a lot of cute graphic t-shirts so I'm gonna fly through these really fast because I have a ton of them. And this one's actually tank top style and it has like a little Jeep there. And most of these are like three or four dollars. So I'm not gonna break down every single one of them because we'd be here forever, but um, this one particularly is a 3T and three bucks. It's another little tank top. Like I said, you can mix and match a lot of these. This one's super cute. Again, like a retro style. I thought it was so cute. This one has, this one does have matching shorts, but I didn't get those. I don't think they had his size in these, but um, he can wear this t-shirt with any of the shorts I bought, so it doesn't really matter. This one I liked a lot because of what it says. It says, Mom's Main Squeeze. Super cute. And then just a basic Henley t-shirt. Again, this one's five bucks, so a little bit more expensive, but still super basic, cute, wear with anything, anytime. And I love these colors for the summer. And then I did pick up a few onesies. So I just got a basic gray. And then this one I thought was really cute. It's got the turtle. Turtly awesome. And then this one says sunshine mood. And then I did get some shorts to go with those as well. So like I said, I bought a lot of these because he can mix and match and then wear them to daycare and I don't necessarily care if he destroys them. So this one's like a more athletic kind of material and then this one is like a thin cotton so he shouldn't get too hot. They'll be comfortable. This one's like a thicker sweatpant material and it does have pockets. This one's that same thicker sweatpant material and an orange color. These are so cute. I love these. They do kind of look like they're going to be see-through, but they're a blue tie-dye and they're kind of thinner too. And these are a green sweatpant material. And I got a mix of sizes because I really just don't know, but I think it should. they should work just fine. This one's more like a... Um, khaki not as stretchy material in like a dark brown color this one's like a sweatpant material in a beige color this will go with a lot and then I got a basic black pair these are actually a little bit longer I think and then a light gray pair and then a light brown khaki short with an elastic waist and pockets. So again, this will go with a lot. And that is it. So 
Like I said, I love everything I got. I know it's a lot of stuff, but I try to get it while it's in stock or on sale. So yeah. So I know that was a lot of stuff. You don't have to tell me, but he needs summer clothes. And I also like to have some things that I don't care if he ruins to send him to daycare in. But anyway, if you are not already, I would love if you would subscribe to my channel. I do make a lot of haul videos. A lot of them are more tailored to toddler boy clothes at the moment because honestly, I just enjoy buying baby clothes so much a lot more than buying me clothes because I'm kind of on a weight loss journey right now. So I don't want to buy too much clothes in my size, but those will be coming soon. So if you like hauls, if you like shopping, if you like mom content, lifestyle, health and fitness, we'll get back to that. I would love if you would subscribe and join the family and follow along for this journey. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you have any um, video suggestions or anything, please leave them down in the comments and I hope to see you in my next